Whoa. This is really, this place is amazing. Oh, come on. <laughs> Billionaire. Whoa. This is really something. I feel like I'm in the future. It's like I can make pizza with my mind. Pretty sure that's a coffee maker. Oh, duh. <laughs> I think it's broken. Yeah. Listen, hey, Dinesh is one of a kind, all right? Are you guys gonna really enjoy meeting him? Well, what does he look like? I don't know, I haven't met him myself yet. Would you like some water? Oh yeah, it's about time. All right. Thank you so much. There we go. I sliced the cucumber very thin. Mm-hmm. It's very good. Organic cucumber from the farmer's market. Oh God, is that gonna give me the shits? No. It enhances the water on a molecular level. The water is really amazing. Thank you. It is. Yeah. Do you know what else is amazing? It was served to you by a freaking billionaire. That's all. Dinesh Rangarajan, welcome to my temple of outstandingness. Yes. <laughs> wow, that is amazing. You know, I'm going to hang on to this glass of water because it might be worth thousands someday. <laughs> <laughs> That's very kind of you, but uh, it's just a super refreshing glass of cucumber water. Let's retain perspective, huh? Yeah, well, but how often are you served by a financier, venture capitalist, entrepreneur? Please, please, you can go on, but I don't like to label what I do, per se. But if I were to label what I do, it would be the business of blowing minds. There he is. The reason that we're all here. Hi. I've washed the feet of lepers. I've combed their hair. But even those dirty, Filthy lepers would be disgusted by what I'm about to do. How am I going to feel about it? <laughs> Classic Spiner. <laughs> Get over here. Okay. Mwah. Oh. Well, that, that wasn't so bad. Thank you for being the person that the whole world can unite in loathing. You on the very bottom rung on the ladder of humanity. Well, I wouldn't say I'm the very bottom. Very what bottom. in the seven moons of Navagraha is this? An angel? Or just the most beautiful thing I've ever seen? It's Dakota. Yeah, I'm, uh, we're actually a thing, the two of us. Dakota. A word so beautiful that they called two states that. <laughs> That ties her with Carolina, Virginia. One of those your sisters or something? <laughs> <laughs> I don't have any sisters. Good, because I don't want you wasting your love on anybody but me. <laughs> uh, we were wondering what we're doing here. In these amazing offices, they were designed to amaze. I should know, I'm the architect. Yes, worked it in organically. God. This must have been so tough to build. Did you have people helping you? Oh, all the finest craftsmen in all the world. <coughs> but we're not here to talk about my architecture hobby. Please, sit. Okay. I mean, unless anybody wants to talk about my architecture hobby, because I... No, no, no. An open it, book. It is an amazing space, Dinesh. But the, you know what? We were wondering, why were we invited? Nice words, Brent. What? Do you do when you're 32 and all your dreams have already come true? Answer, the impossible. Whoa. Behold, my three-pronged plan to do what they say cannot be done. Slide one, the lost city of Atlantis. I will discover it and recolonize it, paving the way for future undersea communities. Slide two. I will bring back the Colombian mammoth. It will be my pilot project for the reconstitution of all Ice Age megafauna. I was gonna donate the first baby mammoth to the Smithsonian, but now I'd be honored if you, Dakota, would raise the first mammoth ever to walk the face of the earth in 40,000 years. Yeah, you know what? As the boyfriend, I'm gonna have to say no. Oh my God, yes! Ah, my own mammoth! Ah!
I don't want to rain on your parade, Dinesh, but I... I'd be very surprised if you could just give away extinct megafauna. Yeah. Oh, my, oh, please, Brent. I would take really good care of her. I would feed her. I would take it's her on walks mammoth, and I... It's a mammoth, Dakota. We don't even know what it eats. Yeah, sweetie. And I gave you that turtle. It didn't even last one day. Gentlemen, gentlemen, please. This is Dinesh Longrejan we're talking about, right? Yeah. Okay, I have 4,000 acres of prehistoric Swiss grass just waiting for that little lady up near Barstow. And you said her. So I'm assuming that means you want a female. Man, that... Boys, we need to make Project 2 female. Yep. <sighs> Slide three! I will make Brent Spiner a star again. <laughs> Come, join me. Oh, yeah. Of course. Oh, Brett, we're both getting cool things. <laughs> Did I hear someone say impossible? Oh, uh, impossible. Not impossible. In impossible. The entertainment industry is changing forever. People say, oh, Dinesh, why don't you buy a network? You know what I say to them? Nothing. I spit right in their face. And then I get out my jet helicopter, which I designed and built, and fly away at Mach 7. Networks are dead. I wouldn't take one if you gave it to me gift-wrapped in blowjobs. Uh, you, know, you know what, just a second. Now, are you saying that you think I'm so pathetic that resurrecting my career is on par with discovering Atlantis? Uh, I mean, you do see how that is supremely insulting, right? I mean, do you know that... <sighs> I'm going to be on the Jolinda show in a couple of weeks. I think you'll find that after my appearance, I'm not quite the long shot that the mammoth is. Oh, Brent, <laughs> it's the fear talking. I've got one word for you. Phones, think about it. What can we count on in life? Religion? No. Our families? <laughs> Our parents don't understand us. And our brother gets mad every time that we open up a competing jet helicopter company and then undercut his prices so that he eventually has to sell. You did that? <laughs> Please, he's a, he's a neurologist, okay? Oh. He's gonna land on his feet, I'm not worried. My point is, is that there are so few things that we can count on in this life. I mean, even love is fleeting. I mean, women leave their boyfriends for rich new ones every day. And you know what? No one falls. I'm standing right here. But we always have our phone. Yes, the phone itself changes, but people are connected to each other, to the whole world, and to their virtual selves through this. <laughs> Whoever puts their face on this is literally in the back pocket of the entire world. There are 2.5 billion people in China and India who don't hate you as much as they do in America, Brent. Oh, well, I, I never thought about that, but it doesn't make a lot of sense. Well, even so, I'm afraid we're gonna have to take a pass on that, Dinesh. Sweetie, why don't you come on? What, what are you go. talking about? Look, you don't want to get in bed with this guy. You can't trust his type, all right? Believe me. What, because you are one? No, because I'm not, okay, hey, 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 you know what? I don't mind you flirting with my girlfriend. It's kind of flattering, in a way. But to do it right in front of me, like I'm not even here, Come on, what do you think? That I'm not gonna just reach across and pop you in the nose before your security can get in here? I, I'm gonna ask you kindly, please. Don't do that. Yeah, well, and I'm going to kindly refuse your request. I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> yeah. What, what the hell just happened? Oh, I dissolved a nano taser into your waters. The cucumber was just a misdirection. Um, but a little bit of advice, if I'm, you know, I don't mean to uh, overstep my bounds, but I think you guys should ditch this clown. Oh, I thought about it myself. Huh? Well, he is our ride home, but would you like my number? Oh, I already bumped you, so I know everything about you. Okay. Well, you too, it's been great. I'm gonna be in contact with both of you. Fare thee well, and take Fountain! It'll save you nine to ten minutes. Huh. <laughs>